It's time for a science lesson from Detective Gumshoe. Mr. Gumshoe, how does electromagnetic interference work? How does an electrostatic motor work? So there must be something inside the room that gives off electrical signals. And we were at the scene of the crime. So there's something at the scene of the crime which gives off electromagnetic waves? Detective Gumshoe is excited by the thrill of investigation. Wow, it was a really good decision to hire him for our investigation team. Right, Phoenix? Well, to be fair, we didn't actually hire him. He just sort of said, Hey, pal, I'm working for you now. But still, he's a good hard worker. And he's going to help us out. In fact, he's so efficient that he's already beaten us to the scene of the crime. Even though he had to stop along the way and pick up a bug sweeper. Poor Detective Gumshoe. Wow, he built his own bug sweeper? That's very impressive. Okay. Okay, I think I understand. We're going to have to use the DS touch screen and just touch anything we think is suspicious, right? Oh, oh, not really. Um, you don't need to touch the touch screen, you can just use the up, down, left, right controls and then the A button to check anything which is giving off a heavy signal. Yes, everybody, be more environmentally conscientious, okay? So there are a lot of things which give off electric signals, but the one we're looking for is over here.
He hurt the poor teddy bear! Wait, what's this? A miniature camera? And a transmitter and recording device? Oh no, just a transmitter. Detective Gumshoe, you are our current electronics expert. Tell us more about this camera. And the transmitter. there be a spy camera in the room where the murder took place? But somebody set it up. Okay. Somebody set it up so that the um, camera would record at a certain time. The time of the murder! Can we track the signal? Can we find out who's receiving the signal? Oh wow! We have to find out who's receiving the signal! Somebody take the entire murder! So, somebody must have known about the murder ahead of time, and set up plans to record it. But who would do that, and why would somebody do that? Aw oh, man, there's no way to track the signal. Aww. What is it? Hey, good plan, Detective Gumshoe. Yes, he definitely is a nice person. about teddy bears. Well, fortunately, Edgeworth does know a lot about tracking teddy bears, and so he's going to come up with a list of people who have recently purchased one of these teddy bears. I don't know, either that or, you know, he's lonely and he wants a teddy bear to sleep with tonight. Either way, Edgeworth is helping us out. Yeah. I don't think it's her either. I'm not sure. I'm not sure who the real killer is. 
I'm pretty sure it was Shelly the Killer, the professional assassin, but... We don't have definitive proof of that yet. Who killed Juan Corita? Who hired the professional assassin? And what is going to happen to Maya? To be continued.